Anxiety is a dread of something bad that will exceed or deplete coping skills. So something bad is going to happen and I'm not going to be able to handle it. We're conscious of anxiety as worry, nervousness, restlessness, thought racing, confusion, inability to focus. To transcend anxiety, view it as a yellow light, not a red light. It's not telling you to stop. It's just telling you to be careful. You're crossing a boundary, doing something different. Figure out what bad thing might happen. Learn more about it. How likely is it to happen? And if it's probably going to happen, develop plans to cope with it. We have a course on anxiety if this transcendence webinar isn't enough to help manage it. Sorrow, an acute form of sadness, occurs when we've lost something of value. To transcend sadness and sorrow, we need to recognize that they have built-in regulators. If we don't blame, deny, or avoid them, they can wreck themselves over time through their hidden motivation to create more value. For example, if we fully grieve the loss of loved ones, we will, over time, experience compassion and kindness for others. If we don't fully grieve or avoid feeling sadness or sorrow, we become depressed and resentful of others. A lot of resentment is ungrieved loss. To transcend sadness and sorrow, we merely have to experience them without indulging them. You don't have to wallow in them. Just allow yourself to briefly experience them sometimes and let them run their course.